a look inside the Aptera EV, the electric vehicle you never change. Aptera, which went out of business in 2011 after failing to secure funding for a three-wheeled electric vehicle, is back with a new solar-powered vehicle that at least most drivers claim will never need to be recharged, and predicts this is the top model with a 100-kilowatt battery, could travel up to 1,000 miles. Hello everyone and welcome to our channel. In today's video, we will be looking into the recent news of the Aptera EV, the advanced electric vehicle and its inside features. But before we get into that, please remember Remember to like this video and subscribe to our channel. Also, hit the bell icon to get notified whenever we post a new video. Let's jump right into it. Aptera is designed for comfort. It requires a smart approach to production simplicity and flexibility. It's easy to use thanks to the center screen, giving you tips on how to control your hands and be more productive. A sleek and nice upgrade with high style and functionality includes central storage with built-in wireless charging, eco-friendly materials such as biodegradable and vegetable leather, recycled PET and 3D knitwear, bioplastic yarn and recycled felt are available. The Aptera is the world's first solar powered electric vehicle that does not require recharging for daily use, giving you the freedom to do more with minimal impact on the planet. Solar electric vehicle startup Aptera Motors has built and unveiled the third prototype of the Alpha Solar Electric Vehicle. The Aptera electric tricycle isn't ready for production yet, but recently in Jay Leno's garage, Jay Leno received a thorough preview of the solar electric vehicle from Aptera CEOs Chris Anthony and Steve Fambro. In 2011, Aptera was closed after failing to get a $150 million loan to manufacture the Aptera 2E, which was certified by the U.S. Department of State Energy. President and CEO Paul Wilbur said at that time, We are introducing new technologies to create a future for more efficient driving. These cars represent the evolution and renewal of what Aptera hoped to build during the company's early existence from 2006 to 2011. Aptera's first implementation collapsed during liquidation because it was unable to get low-interest loans from the Department of Energy's High Tech Department program. Production plans have been revived for 2019, and the three-wheeled vehicle is now being marketed as a never-chargeable vehicle that can draw most of its power from integrated solar panels, which still have regular power outlets. The company claims that you can lower prices by using fewer batteries than by using more batteries, using economies of scale, as many automakers are doing. The new three-wheeled vehicle for two or two adults and one pet features rooftop solar panels that can provide a range of, of up to 45 miles per day. So if you have this top model, add a little solar charging battery. It seems like 1,000 ranges are possible while the panel is parked. As car and driver pointed out, while driving, the car does not run on solar power alone. Aptera co-founder Chris Anthony said in his press release that with Aptera's Never Charge technology, you are driven by the power of the sun and the built-in solar power keeps charging the battery. So go wherever you go. He said Never Charge is built into every Aptera and is designed to collect enough sunlight to travel 11,000 miles per year in most locations. Concluding from the images and specifications of the car, its curvature and lightness are only 0.13. For comparison, the Tesla Model 3 has a drag coefficient of 0.23, and the Volkswagen identification for electric SUV is 0.28. A front-wheel drive vehicle can accelerate from a standstill to 100 kilometers per hour in 5.5 five seconds, and a three-wheeled model can accelerate to 100 km per hour in three and a half seconds. The tricycle boasts 700 watts of solar power that can produce 4.4 kilowatts of energy per day on a sunny California day. Aptera says an additional solar power covering the rear hatch allows a range of up to 40 miles per day under these conditions. Anthony said, even in Ireland's less sunny climate, solar charging is possible for up to 20 miles a day. The Aptera claims to offer a version with a range of up to 1,000 miles, but the 400-mile version has so far been the most popular with bookers. Pre-orders for Aptus Paradigm and Paradigm Plus models now start with a $100 refundable deposit. The company claims to have taken over 10,000 orders for tricycles starting at $25,900 to $46,000, higher for non-standard vehicles. Final development vehicle will be available at the end of 2021, and the Aptera will be put into production in 2022. The the three-wheel design was chosen for competence and provides a drag coefficient of 0.13. It also means that the Aptera is unlike anything else on the road, which can help or hinder, Leno said. 
So that's all for today's video. Let us know your thoughts on Aptera EV and its features. Did you also get fascinated about it? Tell us in the comment section below. I hope that you found this video interesting. If you found this video interesting and informative, do like and subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to give your valuable feedback in the comment section below. See you in the next video with some more interesting information and facts. Until then, stay tuned.